I have come into your house. Say there's something I should know by now, and I vow to do you well. And as you speak, how I feel the sting. Like the hackles on a dog's back, I rise up to meet the things you told me in the middle of the night. They fall heavy like a hammer on your own. You are the light in the darkness, you're the fire on the line. Oh, oh, I have known your ways, but I'm the gale that'll rattle your gate. You shudder, I'll make you shake, and you will find what you did not see. Road last narrow, way not steep, and oh my child, don't you lose your. Remember my table, remember my fate. And the things I told you in the middle of the night. Chop down my tree or hold me under the water. No, when you you will not dig a hole in me, and you will not chop down my tree or hold me under the water. I saw a white-haired child staring out through hollow gray eyes. And I saw men who come to early ends, men who flickered dim and died. I saw the kerosene skyline from the suburbs of the city on the hill. And I heard the clatter of the coin and the yawning of the few that have their fill. Sun, it is a blister rising like the dead. I drag my shadow behind me and I drag my body to the edge of my bed. And with my palms pressed to my eyes, I pray this one last time. If you're something else, I might love you still, but I. Dig a hole.
song words of a Re- words of the revelator um like one those are just sort of like residual images from me growing up hearing bible stories my whole life so you know you, there's a lot of biblical imagery in this album and that's just because that's this you know that was the literature i was exposed to for half of my life um, more than that and so that's <coughs> that just just automatically will find its way in um, that song, a lot of people have thought that that was about uh, the sort of traditional revelator from the Bible, uh, John. Uh, it's actually sort of the opposite of that. Like, um, so that song um, is a dialogue between a young man and an old man. This is sort of the most like complex, weird. There's no way anyone would get what these lyrics are about <laughs> unless I explained it, which is fine. Uh, it can mean different things to different people, but what I wrote that song about, it's a dialogue between a young man and an old man, and these two characters are uh, were written um, as, as two versions of me, um, and the dialogue is sort of about... Um, well, it's, it's essentially the version of me that exists right now and the world view I have and my, the persuasions and lack thereof concerning my evangelical upbringing. Um, and I'm talking to the version of myself that was like three years ago who was um, of a different persuasion. And so it's like the young man is the, the version of me that's you know three or four or five years ago, you know, the version of me a u- more youthful me, and then the old man is sort of like they're having this <clears throat> this midnight conversation, and the old man's essentially telling him all these things that he doesn't want to hear because now that the now that the young man is confronted by those, now that it's revealed, like the revelation has been unfolded to the young man, he now is responsible to deal with those truths, um, and it, and that like it's you know. It would have been easier if he didn't have to, if he could just keep thinking and believing the things he always did. Um, so it's, yeah, he's like, simul- the, young, the young guy is simultaneously like plugging his ears and pushing it away, but also it's just sort of consuming him and there's no way to really get away from, um, you know, the events that are confronting him, so. Uh, yeah, that's what the revelation is essentially, and that's what this this whole album has been a process of that. And um, yeah, it's, it's like a really personal album for that reason. <laughs> 